Hello, welcome back to another edition of Electric TV. As always, I'm your host, Dominic Giratano. On this program, we highlight the very best in electrical construction built by the NECA IBEW Powering America team. And today's story is no different. On campus, at the hundreds of colleges and universities across the country, students are making the critical decision of what to major in. The Powering America team of NECA and the IBEW want to encourage as many young men and women as possible to pursue a career in electrical construction. For that reason, dozens of NECA student chapters have been created to build interest and attract the best and brightest to the industry. Here at Penn State University, there is a very special group of students preparing to design, build, and maintain tomorrow's electrical infrastructure today. This is the story of the Penn State Student Chapter of the National Electrical Contractors Association. We have a great relationship with actually two uh, NECA chapters here in Pennsylvania, so on the western side of the state, uh, as well as in the eastern part of the state, and we're here in the middle. I think the most important thing is that because the interaction is enduring uh, from year to year, and there's, a, there's a, an expressed interest from those leaders to increase their involvement and support us, we just have a feeling like they have our back. It's a huge university. There's plenty of student clubs. We bring something really unique to the students in that they have employers talking to them, they have real life industry expertise, and without that, it's, that's really the backbone of the chapter. I mean, they can find social activities anywhere, and this is really a unique chance to blend a good time, real world experiences, and their studies together. One of the things that I found recently interesting was a study of Penn State students that said their interest in sustainability was largely more informed by their involvement in organizations than it was in their courses. For someone like me who's trying to find ways to grow those opportunities for students, the student organization venue like the NECA student chapter is, is a great place to help expand the types of experiences that they have an opportunity to gain while they're at Penn State. The student chapter program has been a sort of strategic focus for NECA because we know there are manpower shortages in the field, but with the generational changes in the industry, there are manpower shortages in our contractors' offices as well. So these programs and the student chapters are vital for the future of the industry. Years back, we would bring the, the apprentice in, the journeyman in, and graduate them up to foreman and throw the drawings at them and say, call me when you're done and I'll come to the ribbon cutting. We don't do that anymore. You know, things are planned out a whole lot more. This is an active contractor in Pittsburgh trying to find new ways to do things and be creative, trying to find some new talent. Lighthouse Electric is one of our contractors and they're doing the work on Penn State's campus. The project manager on that work is Josh Carey, who uh, is the former president of the student chapter here at Penn State, and he um, was introduced to Lighthouse through the student chapter. I didn't go to career fairs when I was up here. I, I was involved in NECA, and that was my route to a job. So and I, I really appreciated that. NECA really puts you in a good position, and, and it, it gives you an opportunity to work and to network with contractors. It's a really great example of seeing how the student chapter uh, can feed into real work experience and uh, real job opportunities. I'm from Bangalore, born in Bangalore, brought up in Delhi. I've lived in seven different cities in India and now I'm here for my undergraduate studies. I'm majoring in energy engineering. I'm a junior. I'll be graduating in 2018. I'd encourage every single student to get involved because not only do you get engineering and technical experience, you also get a lot of networking opportunities. And above all, you'll learn how to interact with people and look at things from a global, holistic view. Technology really doesn't work unless the business side of it comes through. You could, you could design and develop whatever you want, but if it's not as economically feasible, it's never going to grow. People are never going to buy into it. So I feel like having those two backgrounds together can kind of propel me to any side of the energy industry and just see where it goes from there. The future of the student chapter, as strong as it is now with the help of our friends from Pittsburgh, we need underclassmen. We need you to spread the word. It's a really close group of people. They're all my friends, we're all in the same classes, so not only are we you know, experiencing school together, but we're also experiencing this club together as well, and that, I think that's beneficial. The executive group at NEGA in Penn, New Jersey, and Western PA are great resources for that. They always want to help 
I always want to set up weekends like this, which is fun. We will do whatever it takes to ensure that you are successful as students and as you move forward in your careers. The door is open and the phone is on and the emails are flowing, so feel free to reach out at any point. And I'm really proud to be a part of all of this and the success that you guys have had in the past. Our goal, frankly, is to be the best student chapter in the country. And I know with the help of our friends from Pittsburgh, we're gonna do that. Thanks for watching this edition. Be sure to follow us on Facebook and Twitter for behind the scenes extras and industry information. From everyone here at Electric TV, thanks for the click. See you soon.